Although merging onto a motorway may seem like a straightforward maneuver, many collisions still happen because drivers may not be considerate, aware or skilled enough to find a suitable gap in the traffic to perform a safe merge. In addition, other drivers' movements can be difficult to predict and some highway merging scenarios are particularly challenging due to poor visibility conditions while approaching the merge. Therefore, the decision-making process a driver must go through to merge safely onto a motorway must involve the estimation of several factors. This includes the speed and trajectory of other drivers, and it also depends on the current environmental and road traffic conditions. These factors will then influence the speed profile and trajectory of the driver's vehicle to join the motorway safely. As we move towards full vehicle autonomy on our roads, these vehicles will have to handle complex situations in any road segment or environment. With the support of the Centre for Connected and Autonomous Vehicles, Innovate UK and the WMG Centre High Value Manufacturing Catapult, the Autoplex project focuses on testing new technologies to achieve a widespread level of safety autonomy across road vehicles in complex junctions and highway mergers for the vehicles approaching the main carriageway. Autonomous and automated vehicles offer many benefits for the society. For example, they can help make roads safer, transport systems cleaner and more accessible. Onboard sensors unfortunately have many limitations. For example, in complex road segments, they suffer from occlusions and various other forms of impairments. One promising solution for this problem is to use smart infrastructures to support autonomous driving systems and vehicles in such scenarios. The Autonomous Week's project is looking at doing the autonomous merge. Autonomous merge is one part of many other parts of manoeuvres that an autonomous vehicle would like, need to do. Using infrastructure sensors gives the, the vehicle a lot more information than the vehicle sensors themselves. So everything contributes together and makes everything safer and more predictable. Transport for West Midlands' involvement on the Autoplex project is twofold. The first being the purchase, installation and eventual operation of the equipment on the Coventry Ring Road. And the second is our involvement on innovation projects such as Autoplex form part of the wider organisation's strategy and transport plan around the key themes of avoid, shift and improve. To enable this demonstration, Unix Traffic developed the roadside perception system and worked closely with national highways to ensure its safe and effective installation. WMG and Jaguar Land Rover developed cooperative perception and trajectory planning algorithms for the vehicle and WMG implemented the proof of concept demonstration that you will see in this video. The demonstration takes place in M40, Junction 15, where additional infrastructure has been installed to enable the demonstration of this technology. The radars on infrastructure continuously monitor the traffic on the motorway. It detects vehicle's location, speed and acceleration. This information is then sent to the RSU, where an object list is created and sent over the air to all nearby nodes i.e. vehicles. The information is sent using the CPM, Collective Perception Message, using the ITS G5. The Eagle vehicle continuously monitors the environment using its onboard sensor, while this also creates an object list populated with the detection from Eagle vehicle. The demonstration starts with Eagle vehicle driving down the slip road. The vehicle then receives the CPM message from the infrastructure and obtains the object list from the message. It then combines the two object lists together into one single global object list, which allows for a more comprehensive understanding of the environment to be achieved. So the emerging algorithm uses the newly created object list and the GNSS location of the Ego vehicle to predict the behavior of traffic along the motorway, uh, identify a suitable gap to merge, and plan for the trajectory, heading, and uh, speed uh, of the Ego vehicle to nicely fit into the identified gap. The emerging algorithm continues to monitor the identified gap and makes various adjustments to ensure that the comfort of the driver is maximized and uh, at the same time the road safety constraints are also met. In our demonstration, the output of the emerging algorithm is uh, displayed uh, in a monitor within the Ego vehicle also known as a ghost vehicle or shadow control mode. The showcase demonstrates how 
autonomous vehicle with highway merging functionality would perform against a human-driven vehicle. In the end, we have demonstrated that cooperative perception uh, using a V2X system can enhance key performance indicators associated with highway merging, such as ride quality, uh, describing the effects of various vibrations in lateral, longitudinal and vertical planes on the human body during the merge. The instantaneous acceleration and jerk are also kept within acceptable limits, uh, yielding a comfortable maneuver. At the same time, key performance indicators associated with road safety requirements and measured in terms of the time to collision and time headways between the Ego vehicle and its surrounding vehicles at the merge aren't compromised. With national highways, we know that uh, the growth of connected and autonomous vehicles in particular over the next 10 to 15 years is going to be very challenging. So by taking part in these collaborative projects we learn a lot and we also be able to add to the growing body of knowledge that we have in order to help formulate any strategies, any policies in the future in terms of managing fully autonomous vehicles on the motorway network. By analysing real world challenges and addressing any issues as they arise we're able to develop and share any newly learned approaches that enhance all partners' capabilities and contribute to a quicker and more robust outcome. Autoplex provides us with invaluable insights into how connected technology and V2X messaging actually performs in the real world and how it can be cleverly used to complement other technologies but also enhance the perceptions of the technology and then deliver meaningful safety benefits to drivers of vehicles today but also to all users of the road network in the future. The Autoplex project will enable future autonomous vehicles to make better decisions based upon the data collected during the trial. This will enhance ride quality and safety on local roads and motorways where the trials have currently been taking place. Further technological development is fundamental, however the real objective now is to gain the general public's trust in autonomous vehicles. So the Autoplex project has given Jaguar Land Rover the opportunity to look at not just using, using the vehicle sensors, but using infrastructure sensors as well. So this gives us the potential not just for this project, but, but for future projects. And we could possibly use them towards autonomous vehicle development or for ADAS, Advanced Driver Assistance Systems, going forward. We are in the middle of an exciting journey to develop future mobility systems that are safe, clean and accessible. With the study that we carried out in this project, the solutions that we developed and the knowledge that we generated we believe these will make significant contribution to our progress in that journey.